I was inspired to start Chemtech because I wanted to have a place where people could work, that they would feel like they were part of a family, that they were appreciated for what they did, and that we made a difference in the world. We did something, we accomplished something. Our biggest challenges when we started out was the fact that I was so young. Started with a credit card and $300, and our first big evolution was when we began manufacturing, hiring a chemist, developing our own formulas, getting our first patents, and then trying to make ourselves known. One of Chemtech's newest solutions could literally change the paving industry. It's a capital idea that washes away asphalt without ruining our water supply. David Elam saw the need for an alternative cleaner and helped develop one called PavePro. There are literally hundreds or thousands of gallons of diesel fuel and hazardous orange products spilled on the ground every day in North Carolina. My first memory of working for Chemtech was when I was about 10, 8 or 10. Back then, it was proper to sign kids out of school <laughs> to help family businesses and I would fill in for my dad when his secretary went on vacation and he would lock me in the office and I would answer the phone and take orders all day long while he went out and sold. Uh, probably what excites me the most about the future of the company is I've watched the company change and evolve so much over the last 30 years and now we've brought new blood in my brothers have started working with us they are young and excited to be a part of the business and they're bringing new ideas and and new direction to the company and I'm really excited to see how that's gonna pan out in the future and what the next 30 years is gonna look like my role is important to Chemtech because I'm in charge of everything that you see from our digital marketing to our promotional items to the website to any wearables and premiums. Um, I'm in charge of overseeing and making all of that. When I started working here, my dad tasked me as the digital marketing executive to take what we have done and the legacy that we've built and make it digital. Taking us you know, with a, a strong online presence with social media and our website, our email marketing, everything that we do online and really trying to push it hard and I think that it's changed the way that we do business. Our goal now is same day shipping, getting the product in people's hands as fast as possible and making that process as seamless as possible. And that's not a common thing in the chemical industry. It's, it's a very slow and old industry and, and using social media as like the forefront of everything that we do has, has changed the way that people look at us and changed the way that we, we function on a daily basis. My role's changed over the years a lot. It's gone from just selling to selling and managing to selling, managing, and working with R&D and working on new patents and hiring and recruiting. My role is important in a lot of ways, but I think above all else, it's pushing the envelope. I like to not only challenge myself, I like to challenge the people that work for me and with me and alongside of me, whether they're at the plant, whether they're my salespeople, whether they're uh, in the administrative office. I try to help push the boundaries of what we think are possible to every year succeed in new levels of growth and new levels of attainment and set new records and create an atmosphere of winning for, for everybody from the top to the bottom. We broke every barrier possible and it's all been because of that all in mentality and always giving 100%. So I think what excites me the most is the fact that it is so unknown. Every year we set a goal and break it before the year's even over. So. We continue to set these new goals and new targets and the unknown is so exciting because there truly is like an unlimited possibility and an endless possibility for, for every single facet of the business. Over 90 years ago, my grandfather worked and managed that building. So the American Tobacco Company has a unique history and importance to me as a family. American Tobacco Company also offers our employees an opportunity to be part of the new Durham, the excitement of the Durham Bulls Park, married to the, the history of the American Tobacco Company and the campus that we're on, with the stream running down through the middle, with concerts in the park, with big Christmas parties and events being held there. Every day when you go to work, you're going to a vacation destination. You're not just coming to an office building. 
Our manufacturing is done in Yanceville, North Carolina. We are a large modern facility, about 65,000 square feet of manufacturing on 10 acres of property at this campus. All of our materials that we manufacture are currently manufactured here from start to finish. We manufacture some of the raw materials, we blend raw materials, we package it, we ship it. We have a new facility going online in Sherman, Texas to service that part of the Southwest and very soon a facility going up outside of Las Vegas to take care of the California Northwest market. Today was Fall Festival Day. We had all of our team members from the Yanceville and Durham location come to Yanceville. We had axe throwing, yard pong, horseshoes, barbecue, a great time. We had a lot of people here. It gave us an opportunity to come together, not as a company working in different places, but as friends, acquaintances. Our goal is to be the first in the customer's eyes, to, to offer them an Amazon-like experience, meaning when they call today, they get it tomorrow. To be able to do that, that takes teamwork. So we try to build events that help us build teamwork. In a small family business, you just get to know everybody. So when I started here, I was interning in college. While working here, I've gotten married. I've had four kids. And everyone, especially the management here, David and Star, knows me and knows my whole family and cares about my whole family. It's not, you know, you're not a number, you're not just another person. Everything about what you do kind of matters. So it's very family-like in that way. So work-life balance is one of the most important things to me about working at Chemtech because it allows me to be able to contribute both to Chemtech and also to play a really big role as a mom and as a wife at home. My husband owns a landscape business and we also have four kids ages four to 10. So there's a lot of responsibilities outside of work that take up a lot of time and take up a lot of attention. Chemtech allows the flexibility to kind of fit work together like a puzzle with all of the other family obligations I have. And sometimes it is a puzzle making everything fit together Growing up on a farm, it kind of teaches you that you go, go, go. My role is important to Chemtech because I'm building relationships daily. I'm bringing solutions to my customers and putting a smile on everyone's face. I know I've only been here for about three months, but it always excites me when I have a customer call me and they are just ecstatic about PayPro or how the solutions worked or just calling me to check in on me or to make sure I'm okay. That has really just been a blessing and made me feel like I'm really bringing a solution and building a relationship with everyone in PavePro. I come in every day and we work as a team. We put a smile on everyone's face and I leave every day feeling like I've been very successful with my day. The biggest opportunity for growth in the immediate future is to expand the brands we're currently selling. PayPro, Nisalex, and Avion. How do we do that? That's the challenge. We do that by finding young people who can be as excited about those products as I was the day I started. It's excitement that sells. It's excitement and challenge. The desire to learn, the desire to explore, the desire to be different. Those are the things that grow a company. That's where I see the most opportunity for us and the biggest challenge are finding those people.